sometimes when the doctor gets blood work, he finds an elevated calcium level. It may not be because you're taking in too much calcium. There are some other things that can cause it. Number one, there are parathyroid glands, right, hiding behind the thyroid gland in the neck. And those are responsible for bringing calcium out of bones into the bloodstream. Sometimes if there's a parathyroid tumor, adenoma, it puts out too much hormone, brings up too much calcium in the bloodstream, and when we get too much calcium in the bloodstream, our muscles can get weak, we can get agitated, we could have depression, we could have nausea, we could have constipation. So there are a lot of things that can cause, uh, that an elevated calcium can cause. Now other causes, sometimes a tumor in the lungs can cause an elevated calcium. Uh, sometimes it's too much calcium and vitamin D uh, that we take as supplements. And there's a condition in the kidneys where the kidney doesn't put out enough calcium and therefore it binds itself to the bloodstream. So if your doctor finds an elevated calcium, it has to be worked up. You have to find the cause and then you can find the treatment for that.